It is an exceptional moment for Bears legend Steve McMichael. The official word that he has made the Hall of Fame is expected tonight. And only on our home of the Bears, an exceptional moment for Elizabeth Matthews with McMichael at his home as his team shared the news. Elizabeth. Yeah, guys, we are still awaiting for the official, official announcement to come out of Vegas, but it seems like after decades of fighting, Steve McMichael is a Hall of Famer. From the defensive line to the Hall of Fame, Steve Mongo McMichael is finally getting his moment. Thursday night brought together friends and old teammates. The fact that it's taken, it's taken this long and he's in the condition that he is, um, it, just, it just makes it all that much better. McMichael was diagnosed with Lou Gehrig's disease, or ALS, in 2021, taking away his ability to walk and talk. So but he can still communicate, and he did just that with us by blinking once here. for yes. Does it feel amazing? Yes. <laughs> That's a big yes. That's a big yes. You know, Steve is uh, also, I think, uh, tried to be a, a spokesperson for ALS. It's a terrible disease. Ooh. Um, so I give him a lot of credit for that as well. But I think more than anything else, you know, the whole bear community should be very proud. Since his diagnosis, his wife Misty has been his voice. She's representing her husband in Vegas. I feel elated. I feel um, vindicated. <laughs> I feel um, just very, very happy for him because it's just his life's dream. McMichael has been nominated every year since he was eligible more than 20 years ago. It's amazing. We've waited a very long time and I'm just really, really happy that, you know, that he gets to go to Canton. As the second in franchise history in sacks, Mongo has made history and is doing so again now in 2024. What do you think um, he would say? I can't repeat it. <laughs> now once recognized, McMichael will become the seventh member of the 1985 Bears to become a Hall of Famer. Live in Homer Glen, Elizabeth Matthews, Fox 32, Chicago.